Okay, here's all the parts. Let's see if we can put it together. My Chinese is just not very good, so it says seven centimeters down, so we'll mark it. It says it shows this slips on there. I can't read any of it. Man, this is tough. Wow. Hard to get that in there. There we go. Down to the mark. Got it. This is what the wings go on. And having put together one of these Chinese planes before, I know they use that double sided tape. Here it is. I'll peel it out. Now, I'm going to use my knife because last time I had to peel one side of it off here somewhere. There we go. Now we got it. Let's stick it down on the piece that holds the wings. Just like that. And we'll have to peel the top side off. There we go. Wing goes on here. And here. It sticks down. Now the picture shows there's a piece that fits across the wing joint there. There it is. With a rubber band to hold it down. up on the plastic and there's your wings now here's your piece that holds the rubber bands in the back now you can see I broke the wood we'll have to glue it back after we get it all put together here again double sided tape Take one side off, stick it on this that holds the elevator, peel the other side off, and the elevator goes right there. Stick it down. Now the rudder, once again double sided tape. the other side off and stick the rudder down right here there we are now we'll have to glue this back together but I think we'll put the nose piece on with the propellers just like that here's your rubber bands just make many folds till you get to the right length now we're ready, we'll glue the plane back together. Okay, we glued it. It looks like it's gonna hold, we'll try it. Put the rubber bands on now, turn it over. We've got them folded where we needed them. But the first piece of the rubber bands on the hook behind the propeller, stretch it back at the other ends of them to the piece on the back by the elevator, right there. There it is. Rubber bands on. We're ready to fly. We'll give it a few flights in the house, see how it goes. Here's your first flight in the house. You want to wind the, ele the propeller. You want to wind the propeller clockwise, the way the clock hands go. Just wind it till you think you've got enough. Let's fly it. 
Oh, that wasn't very good. Try it again. Well, that wasn't bad. Looks like it's not made for flying in the house. <clears throat> uh oh, that was not a good one. Let's try it outside. Once again, wind it up clockwise. Now, it's windy out here. See the trees moving over there behind me? Let's see how it does in the wind. I wind it up about 20, 25 seconds. See what it does. Not a bad little flight. Oh, it looked like it worked good until the rubber bands wore out. Try it again. That's a good one. Well, once the rubber bands run out, it don't coast too good. That's a good one until the rubber bands run out. <laughs> 